Here at Rancho Strozzi Institute, the Joe Kata is not taught as a martial discipline, but as a way to build a centered presence, relaxation and action, skillful power, flexibility and agility in coordination with others. When you do your Joe practice, remember two things. First and foremost, remember for the sake of what you're doing the practice. This could be as something as simple and straightforward as I'm training myself to relax in action. And remember your declaration. Before each repetition, remind yourself for the sake of what you're doing the practice. This could be the declaration you have in the professional mastery course or your goals in your life. Second, keep in mind the somatic distinctions of length, width, and depth. Be balanced along the vertical line, from left to right, front to back. Drop the attention to the center of gravity, the dropped open attention. This will produce a centered presence so that you're connected to the body, open to possibilities, and present to others. Why do I say that? I say that because we say that the body is the fundamental source of your power. We don't mean the body like limbs and organs and movement. We mean the body as a domain of action, domain of mood, domain of coordination with others, and a domain of learning. And by training the body, we're training ourselves, not academically, but to be able to move differently in the world. <laughs>